Teens and young adults today are turning to a new form of smoking. It's by using e-cigarettes or vaping. Juul is one brand of e-cig and it's gaining plenty of popularity. News since Jada Huddleston joins us now live in the studio with more on why teens are turning to this new trend. Juul's debut just three years ago and it's another type of vaping. I spoke with two freshmen at Indiana State University today and they both have different feelings when it comes to vaping. Taylor Canada is a freshman at Indiana State University. She says many of her peers have taken to this new trend of using jewels simply because so many others are also using them. It's kind of a stress reliever, and instead of turning to cigarettes in a harmful way, I think the jewel is a little bit better because it does have the nicotine in it, so it does get you, you know, that little feeling of a little bit of a stress reliever. Jewels are small and look similar to a flash drive, but they don't look, smell, or taste like a typical cigarette. Libby Ray is a tobacco prevention coordinator at Chances and Services for Youth in Terre Haute. She says young people often don't know what they're inhaling using these products. You know, most of them, if you said, um, how many of you plan to use tobacco or to smoke, they would go, ooh, no, yuck, right? Um, but when it comes to vaping, they don't think of that as being the same thing, and they don't understand that they are consuming nicotine. Canada says you can expect to see jewels nearly everywhere you go on a college campus. Uh, walking to class, I always see uh, some smoke going up in the air from people's jewels. Uh, even uh, sometimes in class, someone will sneak a little hit real fast. So it's uh, very uh, common for people to be using jewels. Meanwhile, we spoke to other students, and they say you should still be thoughtful of others when you use it. When we were kids, like you go to smoking, non smoking restaurants, it's the same concept, even though it's not the same smell and not the same, like, secondhand smoke on your clothes that you do need to be aware of like who's around you and what's respectful and what isn't. Now we reported back in September that some people suggest banning fruit flavors to keep them away from young people.